This is for a boy between 9 and 11. I'm in a place called Katakosh, just outside of Mosul. This is a, a church that was completely destroyed uh, by ISIS. As we were coming through, one of our team uh, discovered one of the Operation Christmas Child shoe boxes. I don't know who gave it, who sent it, but uh, it touched the life of a child at one point. And of course, we ask people when they pack a box to always pray. You never know where that box will go. Where are the lost? Where are the hardest to get to people groups? Where has the gospel of Jesus not been preached and proclaimed? In Acts 13, 47, for so the Lord has commanded us saying, I have made you a light for the Gentiles that you may bring salvation to the ends of the earth. We live in a broken world, an evil world. Yet Jesus gave us orders. He said, go into the world and make disciples of all nations and baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. We have a job to do. When we talk about going to the ends of the earth, we're talking about shoebox gifts that are taking the gospel to the hardest to reach areas of the world. If you want to bring hope to a broken society, it's the gospel. An Operation Christmas Child is not about passing out toys, it's about the gospel. Each kid, when they receive that box, they're going to hear the presentation of the gospel clearly. They make a decision for Christ, and then they're trained and equipped to go out and share their faith with others. And many times in areas where it's an unreached people group, the Bible tells us the time is now. We're in the South Pacific. I want to reach these islands for Christ. These are the core areas. People don't have any hope. People don't come here. There's no tourists here, but we're going to be here. I'm right outside of Mazlan, Mexico, about six hour drive up in the mountains with Operation Christmas Child. This is where people that are brave are taking Operation Christmas Child to the ends of the earth. We need boxes that are packed by families, by churches and groups, but we also need boxes that are packed online. When you build a shoebox online, these are the boxes that give us access into hard to reach places of the world. We go at great lengths, great effort to take these boxes to children in the most remote parts of the world. It's an incredible journey. You know, the mission of Operation Christmas Child never changes. Children are coming to Jesus. Children are coming to faith. Children are being discipled and children are taking the gospel to the ends of the earth. You know, we have this incredible opportunity to make a difference in the lives of families around the world. And I believe the time is short, but I also believe that our God is big enough to meet every need that we have. And so in faith, I am praying that we make at least 400 shoe boxes now, in order to do that, we need a lot more supplies. So, if you would like to donate, we have the tree out in the foyer with all kinds of supplies that we could use. We also have uh, the QR code that is in your bulletin. Please scan it. It has all kinds of ideas of items that we need. You could give a monetary gift. We will be glad to shop. And you can take home a shoebox and pack it yourself. Another exciting thing is going to happen. We're going to have a shoebox packing party. And it's a fun event where the church comes together in a fellowship time and packing shoeboxes. And that's going to be on October 26th at 6 p.m. So pray about it, believe with us, and go bring in the supplies. Thank you and God bless you.